Hi everyone. In this video, we are going to learn how we can give input to this program by using the interactive mode as well as by using the standard inputs. Before we discuss small information, in the previous video, I have explained you how this JDoodle online Java compiler will work and what are the different types of options exist and how to save your programs online by using your Gmail ID and how you can access all those programs later by using your Gmail IDs on any system. So I recommend you to watch that video first. I will provide you that video link in the description. Now coming to this program, this program is accepting two inputs from the user. First one is the student roll number. Second one is student name. In order to read the input, we are using the scanner class in the Java and we are using next int method to read the integer and next method to read the string from the keyboard. So totally we have to give two inputs to this program. So let's see the first way of giving the inputs that is by using the standard inputs. Everybody know the meaning of stdin that is nothing but keyboard right. So before executing your program, you have to provide the input here. Total, you have to give two inputs, right? First one is roll number. And in the next line, you have to provide the name of the student. So after giving the input here, next you have to click on this execute. Now see here, the program is asking for a roll number that you have already provided as 501 and is also asking for the name of the student and we have provided as Kumar and see here at the last the program has printed the student roll number and student name. So this is the first way of executing the programs and second way is by using the interactive mode. See here there is an option called interactive mode. You enable it. In this mode no need to give the input before the execution. So you first of all click on the execute. The program will ask the inputs one by one. See here at the bottom, what's your roll number? Now you give your roll number and press enter. Then it will ask you for the second input. See here, what is your name? Now give Kumar here and press enter. And you will see the output as your roll number is 501 and your name is Kumar. And please note that if you are using this interactive mode, Make sure that your internet speed is good. Otherwise, if your internet speed is very slow, then I recommend you to use this STDIN inputs option. That's it for the video. Thank you for watching.